step one of this is get your brush, clean it off on your paper towel. If it's a little bit of a color, that's okay. Step two is paint your cardboard white. If you're more advanced, you can fade your white to another color. Uh, but for right now, I'm just gonna do white. Try a uh, go from right to left. I'm gonna go all the way to the edge, all the way to each edge. It's gonna make it look nice and even or as even as possible. And there's probably gonna be a spot where your finger, your finger was a little bit. That's okay. All right, I'm just gonna wipe this real quick. Set it in my bowl, my brush, set the bowl in the brush, set the brush in the bowl. I'll pick this up, try not to get any paint on my hands. Uh, step three, I think I'm on, fan. Fan it, you don't have to do it um, violently. Just fan lightly, calmly fan it, let it get dry. Mine is still wet, but we we'll have to move on. All right, next, while that's drying, you're gonna have some paper. I have this paper, it's old paper, and we're gonna tear it. So it's like, you know, wavy like, um, zigzag could be the word. Um, So now that I tore my paper, I have it something like this. That's my paper. So we're gonna start towards, uh, we're gonna lay this paper on here like this. And then we're gonna take our paintbrush. We're gonna use a stippling. We're gonna stipple down, uh, stipple it here. And once that section is done, we'll move it down, stipple again, then we'll move it down and stipple again. All right, so, See what that looks like. Grip my brush. I'll wipe it off. It can't be super soaking wet. It's got to be just not too wet. All right, so I'm going to put my paper on there. I'm going to start somewhere closer to the top. Bam. I'm going to get blue. You can do a different color. If you have a different color, use a different color. But if you want to use blue, use blue. All right, so now I'm just going to do stippling. And I want it to kind of fade into white. I'm going to do another layer of blue. One more, one more thing of blue. I'm going to wipe my brush a little bit. I'm gonna get a little bit of white. I can't get a lot, just a little bit. And at the bottom of my mountain here, I'm gonna put some white. So that way it fades out. All right, so then I'm not gonna put that back in water. I'm gonna just set my brush on the side. I'm gonna lift this up gently. Bam, and then it looks you know, it doesn't look exactly like a mountain, but it looks mountain-esque. And I'm basically going to do this again, going all the way down my page. So this was the other side of my paper. So let's see what I got. Let me see this one. Right. Let me see. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a different one because I don't want my mountains to look the same. So here's a second sheet of paper I had. This is from yesterday. So put 
this one here. I'm gonna put it right where there's still some blue left over where it's showing. Put that on there, get some blue. I'm gonna wipe it, get some white. Remember, you can't get a lot of white. All right. Gently lift it. There we are. So now I got two mountains <clears throat> or two mountain ranges at this point. All right, let's do another one. I can come back. This is the one I used before. That's this hill or mountain, and I'm gonna move it some. Let's see. I'm gonna put this one like this. And put it right where there's still some blue from the one, the mountain from before. Get my blue paint. For getting white, get a little bit of white. For this one, I'm gonna get a little bit more white. This is gonna be like my last one. So I'm gonna go all the way to the bottom with that. Oh, there you go. Got some mountains here. So that would be pretty much done for that one. If you get it to here, uh, if you want to do extra stuff, you can put, you can try to put some birds up in the sky. You can put a sun or moon in the sky. Uh, other students have put trees down here. Uh, but if you get it like this, this is fine. And that, once you get it to here, just take a photo of it, turn it in. And that's it for this video. Hopefully you guys can get your, your stuff looking something like this one.